first mistake I made is I didn't, I, I dropped out of school. Jail, your life is no longer your own. Guards tell you when to get up, when to eat, when to shower, when to go to bed. When you enter this place, they take all your possessions, cell phone, iPod, jewelry, keys, nail file, even your belt. Want a Coke? Can't have one. There is no pot machine for inmates. Want to listen to the radio? Not here. Want privacy? There is none. Want to watch a movie? Don't even ask. Want a room with a view? Forget it. Isn't going to happen. This is jail. Nothing to look at but walls, bars, and guards. There are guys here that will make your life miserable. Michael Gill is 42 years old. He's been behind bars for 16 of those years. Theft, mostly. Microwaves, furniture, jewelry. He's stolen from residences, from businesses, even from schools. He is a resident of the Vanderburg County Jail in Evansville, Indiana. Did your drug use get you fired? No, but it made me quit. Michael Gill dropped out of high school in the ninth grade started using marijuana when he was 15, methamphetamine when he was 20, cocaine when he was 21. He drank more than a fifth of whiskey a day. My drug use was so intense that I, it, it, it became more important to me than, than, than living, you might say, and having to provide for my family. So I, I chose to do drugs instead. Never went back to school. Why not? Um, I went to prison.